Carolyn, trichologist here at Absolute. Our topic today is food for ferritin. So one of the biggest causes of hair loss is iron deficiency. So when we're talking about iron, we have our iron that we get from food. So it's relevant to what you eat. That will be your iron level. But what I see a lot is very low ferritin. So your ferritin is the storage tank. So when you've got low iron or when you're not getting enough iron from your diet, it's always going to fall on the reservoir, which is the ferritin. So we need to work on not just raising the iron, but also raising the ferritin. And the best way I have seen or helped people to raise their ferritin is through food. Okay, so there's two types of iron that you can get from food. We've got heme iron, which is more from your animal sources, and we've got your non-heme iron. So for our vegetarian and vegan friends, it can be a little bit more difficult, but we've put together a list of all sorts of different foods that you can use to combine. And this is for people who do eat animal products as well. It's all about combining the right food. Now, one of the key things is to eat your iron with vitamin C rich foods. Okay, so first of all, you'd go straight and you think it would be fruit. But we also need to be aware of food combining. Okay, so the rule for the pH and for correct absorption is not to eat your fruit with any other food or any other fruit. So it's going to be a little bit difficult to use your vitamin C rich fruits to enhance iron absorption. So then you're going to fall on your vegetables. So there's lots of different vegetables that actually do contain vitamin C, you want to combine them with your iron-rich foods. So for the non-heme iron, it's your dark green leafy vegetables, um, there's lots of nuts and seeds and lentils and pulses and grains, and even potatoes, surprisingly, do contain iron. So we've compiled uh, a food for ferritin guide, which we're happy to uh, email out to you and use as a guide for your food. And we've also listed a few things not to have like tea and coffee anywhere near your food because they will limit the absorption of the iron. And also um, a little bit more on uh, food combining, the vitamin C uh, rich foods and uh, hints for our meat eaters, our vegetarian friends and also our vegans. Even as a vegan, if you eat correctly, understanding how to do food for ferritin, you can have great uh, iron and ferritin levels also. So that's Carolyn from Absolique. Just drop me an email if you want any more information or if you would like to have a copy of what we put together on food for ferritin. It's info at absolique.com.au.